Muslim friends, greetings to you all. Hope you all are safe by God's grace. Be obedient to your parents. Be healthy, eat healthy foods. Stay safe, stay at home. In last session, we have seen about types of sets. What are the type of sets we saw? We saw empty set, single time set, finite set, infinite set, equivalent set, equal set, universal set, subset, proper subset, and power set, and question set. Then we have saw cardinality of numbers. What is meant by the cardinality of numbers? Cardinality of number means counting the number of elements from the set is said to be cardinality. Then we have seen complement of a set. We will just have a recap and then we will go to exercise 1.3. In this exercise 1.3, we are going to learn about four subdivisions. Complement of a set. We have already seen the complement of a set in the last session. We will just have a recap of this and then we will go back. So u is equal to complement of a set means for first of all complement of a set A is the set of all elements of u that are not in A. That means complement is denoted as A dash. How to find it complement? A dash. A dash means what? U minus A. A dash means union of the set, universal set minus the A set. So I have written A values here. C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, which is given in the example. Minus A value. Instead of A, I am C, D, G, J. So, what is the answer for this? So, minus means we need to cancel. Both the sets we have to compare and cancel the values. G and J. So, what is the pending element? E, F, H and I. This is called complement of a set. Next is union of two sets. What is union of two sets? Joining or combining both the sets. Joining or combining both the sets. So here I have given one example. A is equal to M comma N. B is equal to M comma I comma J. Then union means it is a symbol for union. U A union B. That is equal to instead of A I have written M comma N. Then union symbol. Then instead of B, I will write M comma I comma J. Then union means what is the meaning? Combining as I told you. So M I have written, N I have written, then I and J. M is repeated two times. So we should not write, we should write only one time. That is of A union B. Next we will see the intersection of two sets. See the intersection of two sets. Example. Intersection means common. Common elements from both the sets. Here example is given. A is equal to 1 comma 2 comma 6. B is equal to 2 comma 3 comma 4. In the section means as I told you common. For union symbol is U. For intersection symbol is M. A intersection B is equal to. Instead of A I have written A value 1 comma 2 comma 6. Then intersection. Instead of B I have written 2 comma 3 comma 4. Then see what is common in both the terms. 2 is common in both the terms. So I have written 2 as the answer. Next is difference of two sets. What is meant by difference in the max? It is minus. So it is denoted as A minus B. So example I have written A is equal to A E I O U. Next B is equal to B C E O. Next A minus B. How to find out A minus B instead of A I have written A E I O U minus instead of B B C E O minus means what we have to cancel. What how to cancel here E and O is common. So I have cancelled and we should write only the elements from A. Should leave after minus we have B. Minus B means after cancelling we should leave the B whole term. And we have to write only the first term and pending values. A, I and U are the pending value. Next is symmetric difference formula. We have symmetric difference formula. The question will be asked is find the symmetric difference for the two sets. So A symmetric B. Symmetric means symbol is said to be 
this triad is equal to I have written a select it b equal to a minus b union b minus a. We have to find out first a minus b, then b minus a, then after that we have to combine and write because union is given. We have to combine and write. Then we will go to the exercise 1.3. In exercise 1.3, first sum is based on Venn diagram. I think you have already got the session. Now second sum. Second sum, question A is equal to X is to X belongs to natural number. X is less than or equal to 10. This is the question. B is equal to X is to X belongs to W. X is less than 6. Find A union B, A intersection B, A minus B and B minus A. These four subdivisions you have to do for the same question. So, first question is given in the form of set builder form. You have to convert it into row stuff form. So, natural number starts from 1. So, I have to start with 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Up to 10 I have written. Why it is? It is given as less than or equal to. Equal to symbol is given. We have to write 10. Up to 10. Otherwise, we should not write 10. Up to 9 we have to write. Next, B is equal to. W stands for whole number. Whole number starts from 0. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Because here we don't have. We have the restriction for less than 6. If it is equal to 6, we should include 6. So, up to 5. Next is find A union B. A union B is equal to, instead of A, I have written all the A values. 1, 2, 10. Then, union symbol. Then, instead of B, 0 to 5. So, here B value we have found. Union means what is the procedure? Combining or joining all the values. So, 0 starts from 0. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Then again it's repeated. Repeated value should not be there. After 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. This is the A union B value. Next is A intersection B. So instead of A, I will return A value. 1, 2, 10. Then intersection symbol. Then instead of B, I will return B value. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So intersection means what is the procedure? Common element. See common element 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 are Common. Common means it, it is there for the both the sets A and B. So I have written 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 is the answer for A intersection B. Next is A minus B. A instead of A, I have written A values 1 to 10, then minus symbol, then B values 0 to 5. Minus means what is the procedure? We need to cancel the values. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 gets cancelled. So pending elements from which you should write should write from A only because minus B that means after cancelling we should leave the B set and write the A set alone 6, 7, 8, 9 and 10 next is B minus A B minus A means first you should write P values 0 to 5 then minus symbol then A values 1 to 10 then minus means what is the procedure as we say do digit here we have to cancel Cancel 1 to 5, then we should leave minus A means we should leave after cancelling, we should leave the A set fully and then see what is pending in the B set we should get. That is 0. Next, fifth sum. Next is fifth sum. Find the symmetric difference for the following set. So, question is given as P is equal to 2, 3, 5, 7, 11 and Q is equal to 1, 3, 5 and 11. So, what is symmetric formula? A symmetric B is equal to A minus B union B minus A. In the question is given in the form of P and Q. We can change the formula into P and Q. So, instead of A I have written P, instead of B I have written Q. P symmetric Q is equal to P minus Q union Q minus P. Clear? So next part, what is the procedure to find out? First we need to find out the P minus Q value. P minus Q. So is equal to P values I have written 2, 3, 5, 7, 11 minus and then Q values 1, 3, 5, 11. So I can cancel minus means what have I told you? We need to cancel the values which is common in both of them. 3, 5 and 11 are common. So I have cancelled and we should write only from the first element. 
2 comma 7 first set then q minus p first we need to write q values we should not write p value q value q value is 1 3 5 11 minus p value 2 comma 3 comma 5 comma 7 and 9 same thing 3 5 11 gets cancelled here we need to write only pending element from the q set that is 1 so i have written 1 next we are supposed to substitute in the formula p symmetric q is equal to p minus q union q minus p we have found that p minus q is 2 comma 7 union q minus p is 1 so union means what is the procedure combining and writing 1 comma 2 comma 7 so see i combine and write clear next we move on to the third sum third sum contains 8 subdivision questions so question is given us if u is equal to a b c d e f g h a is equal to b d f h and b is equal to a d e h find so subdivision goes on like this first subdivision is a dash so we have seen already a dash how to find out u minus a u values are written a b c d e f g h minus a value b d f h minus means what is the procedure cancelling b d f and h see b d and f and h are cancelled so pending values from the universal set we need to take and write a c e and g next is second question b dash equal to sorry i have written here b dash is equal to u minus b equal to instead of u i have written a b c d e f g h minus instead of b i have written a d e h minus means what is the procedure a d gets cancelled e and h also gets cancelled so pending values from the b is b c f and g next question is a dash union b dash what is the procedure so for we got the value for a dash a dash is equal to a c g b dash is equal to b c f g so how to find out a dash union b dash instead of a dash write the first value a c e g union instead of b dash write the second value b c f g union means combining or joining so i can join with the alphabetical order a b c D is not here, E, F is here, and G. That's all. Next, A dash, intersection B dash. From A dash, A, C, A, G, and return. Then, intersection symbol. Then, B dash value, B, C, F, G. So, intersection means common. So, C, C and G are common in both the terms. So, C, comma, G. Four subdivisions for the word. Next, fifth subdivision. Fifth subdivision is a union b the whole dash why i have written u minus a union b as we did it a dash is equal to u minus a instead of a what is given in the question a union b the whole dash assume this is as a then what is the procedure u minus a union b i think you have understood so u i have written a b c d e f g h what is a union b how to find out a union b we don't have a and b a union b value so far we didn't find out so find out a is equal to b t f and h b is equal to a d e h union means what is the procedure we have to combine and write combine a b d e f h so see a b d e f and h i written directly so what is this next step minus minus means what is that you have to cancel a b gets cancelled d e gets cancelled f s get cancelled h also gets cancelled so what is the answer c and g is pending clear next is sixth division a intersection b the whole dash as we did it here same way a dash equal to u minus a means a intersection b the whole dash equal to Instead of A, it is A intersection B. Clear? Yeah. So, U value I have written A to H minus. Means A intersection B is what? So, see we have A value and B value. See what is intersection here? D and H. 
cancel and written D and H. Minus means what is that? D and H gets cancelled. So what is the pending value? A, B, C, E, F, G. A dash the whole dash. Next question is this. A dash the whole dash is equal to U minus A dash. U minus A dash. So how to find out? A dash means U minus A. A dash the whole dash means assume U minus A. So whole dash means you have to write inside the bracket U minus A dash. U minus A dash. U values I have written A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H minus. What is A dash? We have found out from the first division. A, C, E, G minus. Means what is that? A, C gets cancelled. E, G gets cancelled. So pending values B, D, F and H. Next is B dash the whole dash. As we did it here, B dash equal to U minus B means B dash the whole dash equal to U minus B dash. U minus B dash. So instead of U, A, B, C, D, E, F, H minus B dash means we got it from the second subdivision. B, C, F, G. So minus means what is that? B, C gets cancelled. F, G gets cancelled. So A, D, E. And H. So we have total 7 subdivision. We have completed second sum, third sum, and fifth sum. Clear? So first sum, fourth sum, and sixth sum, and seventh sum are Venn diagram. First sum, sixth sum, and seventh sum are Venn diagram. Fourth sum is like this. You have 8 subdivisions. Do it as assignment and send it to me. I hope you all understood. If any doubts, feel free to contact me. Thank you children. Stay safe.